Today, history was made in the U.S. Capitol Statuary Hall with the unveiling of a statue honoring the educator and civil rights leader, Mary McLeod Bethune. Here's the first statue of an African-American to represent a state in the hall. She's representing the state of Florida and replacing one of the state's previous statues of a Confederate general. It's an historic and long overdue tribute to a remarkable woman. Mary McLeod Bethune was born in 1875 to, a, to formerly enslaved parents, is one of 17 children who lived in this cabin in South Carolina. She started working in the fields at the age of five until she was 10 when she started school. She was a bright student. She excelled, winning scholarships for advanced education. She became a teacher and in a few years opened her own school for African-American girls in Daytona Beach, Florida. That institution would later become Bethune-Cookman College, now called Bethune-Cookman University. In addition to her work in education, Mary McLeod Bethune was also a civil rights activist. Mary McLeod Bethune spent most of her formative years in fields and went on to accomplish all of that and more. So it's fitting that there's a statue in our capital honoring her with her famous words inscribed on its base, quote, invest in the human soul. Who knows? It might be a diamond in the rough.